There are new concerns about containing the coronavirus as hundreds of American travelers are back in the United States under observation at military bases. It's now been revealed some of the travelers evacuated from the cruise ship in Japan have tested positive for the virus. Health reporter Stephanie Saul is here with an update. That's right, guys. You know, we have several incidents now where people who were infected with coronavirus but didn't have symptoms were allowed to travel. The question is, are they now spreading the virus? A plane carrying about a dozen high-risk Americans who were evacuated from a quarantine ship off of Japan are now in Nebraska. They're being monitored at the University of Nebraska Medical Center for signs of the coronavirus. One patient was transported to the hospital, to the biocontainment unit, because of a chronic condition and um, also it looks like experiencing some uh, mild symptoms. Remainder of the patients were transported to the quarantine unit. There were 454 confirmed cases of coronavirus aboard the Diamond Princess. 300 Americans on the ship were evacuated back to the states. We're exhausted, but we're on the plane, and uh, that's a good feeling. <laughs> Pretty miserable wearing these masks, though. State Department officials say only after passengers were evacuated did they learn 14 had tested positive for coronavirus. All the American evacuees will be under a 14 day quarantine at military bases in Texas and California. And there are now issues with another cruise ship. Health officials are working to track down more than 2,000 passengers and crew members who were aboard the Westerdam in Cambodia. They were allowed to leave the ship after being given given the all clear, but then an American woman who had been a passenger tested positive for the virus. And in Hawaii, officials say a Japanese tourist who was diagnosed after a trip to the Hawaiian island of Oahu is now in critical condition in Japan. And the World Health Organization today said more than 71,000 cases of coronavirus have now been diagnosed around the globe. More than 80% of those cases, though, are described as mild. So people have like a cold or the flu, but mm -hmm. usually mild symptoms. Okay. Boy.